It's Lady Lily back with another video. Yes, I am shooting this video in my bed because it's been a long weekend and I'm tired. But I still need to get this video out somehow, some way. But we're going to get it out. So this is the financial fast, day 8, June 10th, 2018. Um, 14 more days to go. We are now moving into week Two and this is God's blueprint for savings. Main point there is great reward in savings. My pledge for today I will commit today to set aside a percentage of every paycheck for my savings. Genesis 41 47 through 49 states during the seven years of abundance, the Lord produced plentifully. Joseph collected all the food and produced in those seven years of abundance in Egypt and stored it in the cities. In each city, he put the food grown in the field surrounding it. Joseph stored up huge, what's it, huge amounts of grain like, like sun, sun, sand. What? What did I write? Like... He stored up huge, huge quantities of grain, like save of the, like sand, like so of the sea. It was so much that he stepped, that he stopped keeping record because it was beyond measure. And this is a quote. It's hard for us to see when times are good because we forget that there will be bad times. It's hard for us to save when times are good because we we forget that there will be always be bad times too. During good times, we need to we need to what's this? Dig deep and find discipline to save consistently as Joseph did. Jeremiah, I said twenty two and twenty one. I spoke to you in your prosperity. But you said, I will not listen. This has been your practice from your youth. Then you have not obeyed my voice. So the question is, how many blessings are you missing because you spend every dime? Who are you failing to connect with and bless because you don't have enough to share because you failed to save? And in this chapter, it talks about um, two essential savings. You should have um, emergency fund. And then it also talks about um, a life happens fund. So what's the difference between the two? Um, the emergency fund is for really having three to six months of living expenses saved up if you lose your job or if there's been a decrease in your job, um, you can pull from the emergency fund to, you know, have to cover um, living, necessary living expenses. Um, a life happens fund. Life happens fund for things like, oh, the wa uh, washer stopped working. Oh, we need a new tire. Oh, we got to get this fixed. Oh, we got to get that fixed. That is more like when things happen because they will happen. The problem is that people don't prepare for such things by saving. So they seek to solve the problem by borrowing. They don't wait on God or... Let me see. They don't wait on God or, or hear God's warning about the importance of saving when times are good to cover their costs when times are bad. And um, that was pretty much it. The daily assignment today was to uh, commit to saving at least 5% of um, every paycheck. Um, if not 5%, commit to saving some percentage of your paycheck every time you get paid. And they also wanted you to do the, wet, the, the network um, statement worksheet. So that's pretty much it. Um, I completed day eight, which was kind of easy. Well, it could have went left, and I'm going to tell you why. No, I didn't spend no money, but there was 
a small temptation. So today was our Greek picnic that we had, we have every year. So they decided this year to, um, have vendors, um, out selling things. And there was a guy who sell these cups that have like the fraternities and the sororities shields and logos on them. And I have always admired those cups from afar and uh, he was out there today, and I said, ooh, uh, you know, I might end up breaking my fast because I've always been interested in these cups and leave it to my old tr um, old sore to say, nope, it's not worth it. You don't need it. You're going to get, you know, you're on track. You're doing um, good, so you don't need to get those cups. So, um, and then I was so busy running around setting up you know getting things and i think i was pretty much tired anyway so i didn't get the cups i didn't spend any money um so that was good um uh, like i said um picnic today we pretty much ate in the park all day today and i did get to bring some food home um and i actually had food to eat tonight when I got home and then it was food for me to have a meal tomorrow with so that is it that is all stay tuned for more videos like comment subscribe stay tuned for day nine hang in there